Hello, sorry, I probably should say stuff instead of just typing into my keyboard. Do do do. Oh yeah, don't worry about Dark Void. I'm not a... I don't mean anything bad to the community, but I'm a... Also, ding ding happening. I should turn that off. Hang on. We won't be having that noise anymore. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hello, Shade. So... <clears throat> there we go. Let me adjust my settings here, because I now have a... Good, good, good. You're gonna hear some noises for a little bit while I get everything set up, because I haven't played Borderlands 2, well, in a while, actually. This also means I'm gonna have to adjust my volume settings, so you... Hopefully it's not too loud. And I know you can't say anything right now, I'm launching, I'm technically launching the game for the first time, despite the fact that I've had this game for a while. I also can't see anything, because it, because the game decided, hey, you know what's a great screen resolution? 640 by 480? Yes, yes, yes. <sighs> Picture will be up soon. As soon as it wants to load everything in. But how's everybody's Thursday? Okay, it's taking a while. There we go. Uh, right. Resolution. Hey, why are you going to this weird ass resolution? Why? Uh, game has kind of semi crashed on me. I'm waiting for it to come back to me. Oh, this happened last time too. Alright. Welcome to Tech Difficulties. This happened earlier today, actually, when I was playing, when I was, spoilers, I was recording, uh, I was recording, doing my initial reactions recording for Border, for, uh, oh, sh there you go. Now it gave me all the other settings. Jesus Christ. Depth of field, we turn that off because it acts yeah, weird. Yeah, it's like I, re I, on physics load that up good okay let's try that again all right well enjoy the re3 demo i just got a notification that that was going on on my screen as well there we go hey Sorry, I sound like I'm... I sound like a spazoid right now, I'm pretty sure. While I'm trying to go through all these settings. Turn this down a little bit. And then we can adjust the volume again later once, once it gets to that point. But I just want to get this all started for now. There we go. 2K, gearbox.
Actually, that means I have to pull my keyboard a little bit closer to me. Close to me, close to me, close to me, close to me. What did I do? Why would I do that? What? I... What have I done? I'm done. Nothing wrong. I'm innocent. Ignore the violent. Ignore the violently green gauge. I think I might like playing Mechromancer. Why do... I have issues. Anyway. We'll select a new one, so... <sighs> so... While we get started here, because we're not playing as Gage at all. Also, she has a hole in the back of her jacket, I've just noticed. I, that, that's what it looks like, anyway. I really hope that's just a decal. So, minor story time. So, as I've been saying on Twitter off and on, uh, my computer had crapped the bed. In fact, the last stream I did, I believe last Thursday? Yeah, the last stream I did for you guys... ...was... Basically, I figured out the issue of why everything crapped the bed as it did. See... Strackers, the mod I had been using to help highlight the stuff in, in uh, Monster Hunter World to make sure I don't miss additional drops. Well, it turns out that was causing the issues I was having the last time I streamed on last Thursday. Well, it was a little bit of that, a little bit of my CPU overheating. I've got some new fans here now, and so if you ever see bright light, if you ever see very rainbow fluorescent lights on this side of my face, it's... Let's see. Uh, the GPU has rainbow fan. The CPU has a rainbow fan. I have two additional intake fans that flash rainbow colors. Yeah, the case is very much rainbows right now and I'm not gonna mess with this because I just putz with that to get the background going or the uh, green screen going behind us here so yeah CP but yeah it was basically Strackers loader at the build I was playing it on was having issues with most high-end builds of PC of PCs but but me thinking as I am putting everything in, I thought oh it's probably overheating because I ran CPU temp to see what was going on. Oh, it's overheating. It's running at 90 degrees at, at high end. That's not good. 90 degrees Celsius, by the way. I'm going to try and reapply the thermal paste. AMD motherboards don't have a... Don't have... Don't have a proper locking mechanism for their chips. All it is is it's like... It's just like a set, it's just like a set of pins or like you set... Or for the CPU, by the way, if you've never seen a CPU, you might want to Google search this to kind of understand this better. CPUs just have pins that go in, and then all it has is just, it just has a little, like, sewing needle thick pin that you grab and lower to do this. To semi-lock the pins in place. So that, so that locks the pins from going side to side. Doesn't so much lock it up and down. So I went to grab my, so I went to undo everything to pull the CPU, the two, pull the CPU fan off to redo the pins. Bent a hell of a lot of the CPU pins. Broke off one of the CPU pins of the like 90 to 120 on there. And basically left me high and dry for, oh, but for another half of a week. So I had to order a new CPU. So I bought my CPU twice now. But with my friend's help, who is uh, who is more A plus certified than I am, 
You help me get it in, get it properly thermal pasted, all of those bells and whistles. So as you can see, we're running fine now. Everybody's happy. And in fact, I will put it, well, I'm not going to go get it, but just know the, cul the, cul the bad CPU of the culprit is in the other room. But yeah, so basically I've been, I've basically been out of work streaming and recording for the past week and a half because CPU parts. But that's all behind us now. It is time to enter the borderlands. So you want to hear another story, huh? One where the very fate of Pandora hangs in the balance. Also, I'm going to talk now because this is about the volume between the two games. How loud is Borderlands 2 compared to me right now? We're about the same volume. Uh, this lower or me lower? You can hear me over the voice. They were wrong. So I might lower this by I might lower the game by a little bit more. A priceless alien element. Soon the rare and valuable minerals so, emerged all across Pandora. So as it's as it is, I win I've got at this point I've gone through Borderlands 1 with you guys, for those of you that watched on tw on uh, tw on Twitch when I did the first time. I have and bring order to the savage planet. Through their explorations, um, Hyperion uncovered evidence of an even greater it? I have played through Borderlands 2 at this up to a point. I haven't done all the DLC the for Borderlands 2, but I have played and beaten the main story of Borderlands 2. Hyperion weren't the only one searching for the next vault's alien power. The call of danger and loot is not so easily resisted. So that's what we're probably going to do Some off and on. came to Pandora in droves to uncover its hidden secrets. Some yeah, gambling is a big thing in this game. Big gamble. Others call them fools. But I call them vault hunters. Our story begins with them. And with a man named Handsome Jack. Hello, Handsome Jack. Hey, guess what? We are going to not watch that scene. Because it is copyright all the hell. Anyway, I'll lower the volume a little bit more. If it gets too quiet, you just gotta tell me. Let me have the game come back. There it is. So... Minor story time in this. When the game first came out, I wanted to play Salvador. A.K.A. the Gunzerker. And then when I played it with friends, uh, well, the group of the group that at least Shade knows, Lucky and the others, I played as Axton. Because nobody wanted to play as Axton. And then in my own time, I basically have, have played with too many games as Gage. For reasons being that she ends up becoming the... She ends up... She can be one of two things in the game. She becomes the... She is the super, super long-range, take advantage of every element in, in the game character. Or the, or the, this is the distance I am from my enemy at all times. Because my accuracy is so bad, but man that damage. But today, it's Krieg. I misspelled Krieg. Hold on. We have to go to the Twitch page. Huh, what a surprise. I just got an email from Twitch telling me what the top play games being played right now are. Oddly enough, I've seen game... Okay, this is kind of relevant, but... I've seen somebody play some, uh... Sorry, it's coming back. Uh, let's see. Uh, tab to back? No, escape to go back. Okay. 
Right, I forgot this had a minor collaboration with Minecraft. No. As of the data that was sent out to me, also... You know what? Let's see Creek's face. Even though we will never see Creek's face. Let's actually see Creek's face. Uh, for those of you who don't know, for those of you who don't know, don't, haven't known of it, Creek is basically a... He's a, he's a psycho. He's the he's the guys that just run around spotting BS all the time. He is a psycho that's had like something tick in his brain where like he's basically having a split personality battle in his mind right now. So in his head, he is calm, cool, and collected. On the outside though, he is still a psycho. But, um, let's see. So, yeah, but no, Twitch was telling me, top top games right now, top games being played right now, League of Legends, Call of Duty Warzone, just chatting, music and performing arts. None of the games that are coming out this week, or our people have used VPNs to get today, are being played, are top played right now. Yep. And actually, I kind of want to play... I don't know if I want to play uh, Call of Duty Warzone. I've seen somebody else play it. Also, I'm going to adjust my microphone a little bit. <clears throat> I kind of want to play Call of Duty Warzone. Because, yes, it's a, it's a Battle Royale type of game. It is a battle royale type of game, but like it's doing certain things with it that I think it actually benefits the genre a whole lot. I like what it's doing. I am a CL4P TT steward bot, but my friends call me Contrap. Or they would if any of them were still alive. Like anybody who knows battle royale, basically here's the big change change to note. Here's the big changes to note. There there are places you can go to to spend money which you acquire while playing the game to buy loadouts and buy weapons. So you so you're not stuck with what you find on the battlefield. You can get KO'd once. And then you get taken to the gulag. When you get taken to the gulag, you have a chance to put yourself back into the game. If you win your gulag fight, you go back in the game. If you lose, that's it, it's over. And that's kind of it. You can also buy the, the typical. You can also buy the typical Call of Duty fares like UAV scans, aerial strikes, all that stuff. It's kind of nice. Oh yeah, if you play with squads, I think there's a solo mode where you cannot be bought back, but that's that's just solo mode. Also, I am flickering. My screen is flickering a bit on my end. It's not distracting me from playing. It's just, it's happening. I have a bus saw. So the whole thing with this is I'm going to try and do all the quests. I'm not going to try and get all the little secret collectibles that hide around the area. Okay, it's not stuck on me. Sorry about the mess. Everything Jack kills, he dumps here. Bandits, vault hunters, claptrap units. If I sound pleased about this, it's only because my programmers made this by default tone of voice. I'm actually quite depressed. Now, the creatures around here are dangerous. None more than this bully mong named Knuckle Dragger. Everyone I know. Anyhow, I keep a pistol in the cabinet over there for emergencies. But in here, we should be pretty safe. <laughs> he says, knowing that the ceiling's open. My eye, ah! 
So anyway, I hope you, I hope you guys aren't seeing the screen flickering. It's, I think it's mainly only, only on my end. But anyway, so I will go for. I will go. I will like find some things around here, and I will. Oh hey, it gave me the guns. Uh, I will open up. I will look for some stuff. I'm mainly gonna do all the quests. I'm gonna mainly do all the main quests from this game, but outside of that, I'm not gonna like go and try and find all the secret collectibles, yada yada, so on and so forth. Yes, yes, yes. I know, I know. I bought the Super Chocolate Edition of the game. I'm well aware. Thanks, game. Actually, there is not a shotgun in this collection, is there? Let's see. Let's do that. Yeah, so. I just really hope that you guys don't have to suffer from that. Because it's happening a little bit. It's having a little bit to me, but not enough to like make me want to stop playing. So, um, what was I gonna say? So I, so just earlier today, I recorded my Think Fast on Borderlands Three. I will say, the biggest quality of life change from this game to Borderlands Three, or I, or I guess also from pre sequel to Borderlands Three. Open up a chest, stand here for a second. The game picks it up automatically. So in Borderlands 3, everything is just picked up as you open chests. You don't have to hold E on every chest to grab everything out of the chest. Like, that's so minor, but man, is that so... Like, it's so minor, but man, is it such a quality of life update. You're gonna run into, you're gonna run into nothing. Get him. Punk him. I'm gonna punk Claptrap. Punked him. Did it. Scooter, you're not playing Monster Hunter. Shut up. Also, this will probably be the only time I, uh, this will probably be the only time I'll end up using a sniper rifle throughout this entire playthrough, just because as soon as I get assault, uh, better assault rifles and a shotgun, that's probably what I'll be with the whole time. Thanks. You know, I definitely wasn't zoomed in and shooting a dude. Thanks. I'm just, I'm just bad at like precise aiming. That's just my issue. I'm bad at uh, being really precise. Oh, this is a Jacob, so that explains a lot. Listen, Angel, I don't like this funny little robot. No, he can stay there. There we go. I feel better about my aim already. Oh, hey, a proper bully mom. Nope, I'm going to leave you in there. I wish I could. 
But yeah, so I will. Oh, there he is. Let me explain how things work here. Vault hunters show up. Vault hunter looks for the new vault. Vault hunter gets killed by me. You see, you see the problem here? You're still alive. So if you could just do me a favor and off yourself, that'd be great. Thanks, pumpkin. Well, here's the problem, Jack. I can't. I I could off myself, but you know what would happen? I'd respawn because of your the Hyperion. New life machines. New you machines, as it were. By Hyperion. Your corporation. Hyperion. You know, Hyperion run. Hi, Knuckle Dragger. Don't throw it at me. I asked you not to throw it at me. You don't listen very well. And now... And now you don't function very well either. Eh, too much. You think you're safe up there, that's cute. Money! It's raining money. Why specifically wall sphincter? Got my eye? Great! Now we just gotta find someone to put it back into me. Much as I'm sure you'd like to jam your fist into my skull, optic surgery is best left to professionals. My pal Hammerlock in Lyersburg can fix me up. I'm on C. Lyersburg's on the other side of this Hyperion barge. What say we cut through it, John? Please hurry up. Ha! This door's Hyperion Tech. Child's play. And open. Access denied. Stop talking. Stop talking. You're welcome. Perks of being an artificial intelligence. I'm networked into almost everything on this planet. It's a long way to sanctuary. Fark, that's not a that's not a nice way to say Animal Crossing New Horizons. And shotgun time. We're done here. Let me know when you're ready to go meet with Sir Hammerlock, minion. Exactly. I'm a conductor of the poop train. I actually have. That's actually the, the exact skin I have equipped on right now. Is poop train conductor of the poop train. Oh, I mean, they're out there. Apparently, apparently, Animal Crossing fans are fl are flipping the bed, as it were. I would say much more, much worse words, but um. Um, was it? I saw a post earlier today. I may have just been blown out of proportion because you know. It may have a. Uh, it may have been blown up proportion because you know, because you know, people on social media like to do that kind of thing. But um, it was like Animal Crossing, Animal Crossing, Animal Crossing fans who see almost half the Pokédex was cut, was was cut, laughing. Animal Crossing friend, Animal Crossing fans seeing one froggy chair missing, freaking out. 
I'm going in. Also, anticipate me using a lot of these kinds of guns. Playing so much gauge in this game normally, I am very prone to use breakneck and low ammo count guns. Stop. Oh, he's up here. I missed him. Don't worry about it. Come on, dude. You're going too slow. Hurry up. Good. Apologies, but when Claptrap speaks, I feel my brain cells committing suicide one by one. I shall be out directly. A pleasure to meet you, Bolt Hunter. I am Sir Hammerlock. Hunter. Scholar. Gentleman. At your service. I came out here to research the bully mortars for my almost defense men trapped me on this place. Now let's see, while you do that, I'm just gonna Oh, I can't weasel my way up. I'm headed to sanctuary myself. From what I hear, the Crimson Raiders there could use a hero like you. Now, if you could hand me the robot's eye, please. Okay, I'm leaving. I'm gonna loot your place. Listen, he would do the same. Stop talking. Stop. Oh, hey, Eric. I, I'm sorry, I had to connect aliases together. Happy Animal Crossing Eve to you, buddy. Yeah. I was playing that a little earlier today. I was recording my Think Fast video on it. I already told these guys a little bit, but I... I was recording my Think Fast video on, Bo on Borderlands 3, so it's it's got to be edited still. But, I mean... It's what is it? There, I they all they added one thing that was a huge quality of life update, and I needed it immensely, and it's in there now. There you go. I cleaned up the berg. I now have a shield. Congratulations. Hey, let me let me do this. Uh. Yes, I see it. Also, not skills. Uh, backpack. That. Eh. Liasberg, I see no reason that wild bully monks should lollygag about the place, disrespecting the memories of the former town. All right. Anyway, time to go kill bully monks. Hey.
I I understand. I've already I've already put it in my bag. All right, I was saying. I was saying and I got distracted. I do love the uh, the one quality of life update is just you open something that has goodies in it. You don't have to sit there and hold E on it to collect it all. You just kind of zoops into your body. Okay. You have fun with Animal Crossing and or Doom yourself, my friend. I missed. I hit. That's a big boy. That's no longer a big boy. I like how I said I have issues with with uh, precise aiming, and yet here I am, bullseyeing bull bully bongs. Whatever. Eh, who needs iron sights? Also, we're just going to hear Krieg talk a lot, and it's going to be disturbing, to some extent. Hi, I finished your quest. Open the gate. Pull the lever, Kronk. I don't need to use my map. I know where I'm going. I played. I played too much. I have played far too much of Borderlands. Borderlands two specifically. And Farf has gone off the deep end. Unfortunately, the po unfortunately the pool is all deep end. <laughs> I missed. My bats, my bats. Stop moving, stop moving, stop moving. Thank you. you make me vomit. <laughs> I missed. Don't move. Got him. <laughs> don't move. Money. Right. I. I why does money not embrace my love? I'm trying to be like Mr. Krabs. Hold on. The safe house power box stopped working after Claptrap attempted to integrate with it. Now, what a kidder. Just get a new fuse for the elevator and ignore what he said about that power box. Okay, taking a fuse. Let's see, can I see anybody? Outside right now. Oh, there was somebody. So just do the smart thing. Get to a point where you can see where you can see your target and remove them. Missed. Oh, hi, buddy. Hold on, I just need to back up. Excuse me, hold on. No, you could not have said it more eloquently, Krieg. Oops. There he is. Listen, you always go for the head meat. Hello? Hello? Mein Freund? Friend? Where are you? There he is! Did you just throw a Sir, did you throw a grenade at me? That's rude. I don't have those yet. That's rude to give- to throw- use something against me I don't have. Ooh, 
Ooh. Elemental gun. Anyway. I think... Or shoot the fuse box, Claptrap. You know it's an alternative. Yes, yes, I'm well aware of... of di Please, let me play the game. There. Oh, hi, Bully Monks. I wish I had a faster shooting or faster reloading shotgun. I like breakneck shotguns, but I need something that's a bit better. Or I need my skills, maybe. I'm walking at you now. I think I'll get it. There we go. Doop to do, just doing my job, don't mind me. This is fine, don't worry about it. There we go. Now he dropped a green up there, and I would like a green. Where did your green go, Mr. Man? I feel like just talking like I normally do when playing this game, I'm going to sound like a madman. And it's going to feel like I'm trying to play in character, yet I'm not. I don't know yet. I figured it was going to be a bridge to cross when I get to that point. Although it sounds like no matter what tree I go down, a lot of Krieg's usability, a lot of Krieg's like viability in this game is tied to skills he doesn't get until he's like level 20. Hello, Kiza. Welcome. Welcome to Stram. It's gonna keep by a shield. Well done. Now, if you could return to Lyersburg, we could see about getting you off this frigid glacier. Oh, I need to sell things. Don't worry, I can handle this. Don't give me a second. Let's see. Feel like I probably sold a. I pro feel like I probably sold something I was hanging on to level five for. Whatever. I thought there was a treasure chest out here. Ammo chest. Uh, let me see. Now let me read this wall of text I ignored while I was do doing t t inventory things. Okay, I played let's I played let's go Eevee. I th actually I think I played most of it on stream with you guys. That seems to be a lot of my thing now is that like I don't have a lot of me time games so to say. I play a lot of stuff with you guys in tow, as it were. 
Let's see, tab. Actually, isn't most of the coming quests just going to be triggered if I go back to him and get, like, five quests done? Bye. Over his shoulder. Oh, hey, that's one of the things I need. Ex ex excuse you. Excuse you. Cease. Hey, where are you going? Where are you going? Okay, but here's the other thing, actually. Uh, here's something else, actually, I just remembered. So, as I said, playing Borderlands 3 earlier today. Here's the other thing that I... that Here's the one thing that's actually kind of... I'll probably get used to it, but here's the one thing that's kind of bad from Borderlands 3... That, well, you know, from Borderlands 2 to Borderlands 3. Uh, if you, because I like to use shotguns a lot. If if you shotgun an enemy enough, like, they stumble, and that throws off my aim so bad. Uh, let's see. Yes, please proceed to the southern shelf and defeat the long for me. No, you are sad and I have no desire to speak to you further. So I guess Yeah, like I said, I'll probably get used to it, but just like start like basically I had just finished like before this, the last game I finished of the series I finished playing was Borderlands One. So even then, I'm I'm not used to enemies going down. I'm used to enemies stubbornly standing up in my face, and then when I, and then when they are out of life, then they go down. Listen, it was definitely a good use of my time, money, and ammunition. Don't judge me. Okay. But I, I, I'm i sorry, Farf, but I gotta call you a liar on that one. Cause, because they fell over when shooting them. With a shotgun. So let's see. Ah, melee attack him. Got it. Hey, you dude. Taste your lungs. Okay, but how cool would it have been if that actually had done enough damage to him. I didn't need it. Eh, I gotta kill it. I gotta I gotta put him out of his misery. Hey. Oh I can switch guns good. Doop to doop to do run circles avoid damage as I eat that shot. Stop throwing things at me. I could probably melee him now. Of course. Come here. Come here. Give you a sniper rifle. I'll laugh at his offer. Ha! If you bring me the 
Bob and weave, bob and weave. I can't move to the right. Stop running. And there he goes. Done. Nah, I want shotguns. Okay, so Blackburn Cove. Now see, there's two ways I can do this. I can do it the smart way, or I can swag. Swag. Aw, oh, no badass token to, to, to turn in. Also, should probably note, I probably have too much badass rank to even be probably playing this properly at all. Oh, good. I can throw grenades. Let's give Creek grenades, because that's a good idea. Can't swag that one. Good job, Krieg. Doing the Lord's work, I see. Uh, yes, I pl I'm playing on computer right now. Beep, bop, boop. Oh, I see a target. Boop. Shut, 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 shut up. Dang. Oh, yes. Let's anger everybody. Take. Those are all work at the best at all times, my guy. Oh. Uh, I don't know what grenade mod I had, or where that grenade was going. Oh, well that happened. Well, let's start, let's start the fun. Press F to start your buzz up, axe amp rage. Huh, okay. So I have my skill. Let me see here now. This sounds fun. Uh, basically, it's like reading the. It's like uh, killing an enemy increases your reload speed for each stack of bloodlust. What is bloodlust? Okay, bloodlust is a ba passive thing that happens. Oh, here we go. Increase for each stack of bloodlust. Killing an enemy increases your weapon swap speed for each stack of bloodlust. Well, I don't think I'll need that, so I would go with this. And then... Okay. Bye for now, Shade. Stay safe out there with the obvious happening. Killing enemy with your with a 
Bolt increases your melee damage and reduces grenade fuse time for each stack of bloodlust. Nice. So he's meant to like, so at least in this tree, he's basically supposed to be using explosion element or elemental weapons as a whole. Axe go boom. Okay, so let's read the last one. When added or below 30% of your max health, instant, uh, remaining instantly refills your health and transforms into a badass mutant. It's like a mutant. So increase melee damage, salt the wound. This is what's going to be enough for me while I plan out what tree I want to go down. Sorry. Take damage while, it, while your shield is down as to stack of salt. The wound increases. Uh, increase the melee shot dam shotgun damage for each stack accrued. Stacks begin to decay after a short time without, without taking health damage from enemies. Isn't there? Isn't there? Yeah, there it is. So I think there's a skill that just gets, upon death, you drop a free grenade. I feel, isn't there, isn't this tree like, doesn't this tree have something that's just like, you get no shield? Or is that like from another tree? Station of all burn effect. So he likes. So basically, this tree he likes burn. That the far the uh, bloodless tree he likes explosive explosion and or g elemental damage in general. I might. I actually might go down bloodless tree. Just cause kaboom. I like kaboom. Anyway. Oops. His head's missing. He, uh, you missed as bad as I did. Missed. Oh, I have firework grenades. No, it is. Mine. Well, considering that's the tree, the tree I'm going down, it begins. Alright, sniper rifles are out of the question. Boom. We we deal boom and more and his brother boom. Okay, I didn't get there in time. Okay, now where is everybody? Hello? Sirs? Sirs! Do you have a moment to talk about our Lord and Savior explosions? Mr. Torque, I'm a fan! Excuse me. Oh, hold on. Have fun!
Where are you? Oh. Well, I can always reclass to fire, but it's basically like if I were to go on the fire tree, it's more or less I just need I just need to like I would need like every single one of my weapons to deal fire damage. If I was if I were to go down that tree. So I'd be like uh in the future, if I've got some in the bank that's just like, oh yeah, I could use these I could use this fire damage kind of scenario. Anyway. I'm going out to the boat. Boat, 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 boat. Actually, this is not the right way to the boat. You're gonna make me fight it before I can go boating, aren't you? All right, let's get this party started. I want an explosive shotgun. I really do. Oh, it's below me. Shield broke. Aim potato. Well, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to throw a... I meant to throw a... Oh. I'm gonna go down again. Let me hear those screams. Oh, that happened. Okay, Elsa, hold on. I hate this grenade, actually. <laughs> oh, hi! Hold on, actually, we're going to change out that shield really quick. Yeah. So I feel weird. Not... Stop that. It feels really weird that I'm... That on this day, on this... Well, this evening, like, basically in three hours' time, everybody's going to be sitting there either... Well, I guess... Maybe three hours' time. Everybody's going to be playing either Doom Eternal or Animal Crossing New Leaf. And I'm not going to be playing either of those games because I haven't bought Doom Eternal and I'm not a huge fan of Animal Crossing. Anyway, let me just uh, unleash the Hounds of Hell as it were. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Stop running away. I'll just hit you both at once. I'll throw this grenade and probably die. Never mind, the, that grenade's stupid. Fire 8? Huh. I like this more, I think. Oh, I'm full. Yeah, I like this more. So then we'll come over here. And we'll just... Oops! New Game Plus... Pl Wait, I didn't even know it was New Game Plus Plus. I knew there was a New Game Plus. I wanna hear you scream! Okay. Let's hear the... Let's hear those bones break. Oh. Huh. Hey, 
So yeah, I think I think we're going down the bloodlust tree. Yeah, that's this is a bad skill. Why would you want weapon swap speed? Why would I want any of those guns? Wow, bad red chest. Alright, I should probably... Do that. Oh, come on game, really? Every time I do something? It does, but yeah, as I was saying, it does seem kind of weird that like, here I am, you know, it's... It's the eve of g games for every for the both extremes walk of life of gaming, and I'm just sitting here like, nah, I'm good. I'm gonna play some Monster Hunter, game a game that came out on PC like, like, two, like two months ago. That's my that's what I'm doing. Oh, that was a boom element, wasn't it? I don't want to double up on that anyway. Shotgun. I think it was a better shotgun. Let's see, where is compare to Sure, why not? Ah, Teddy Ors, gotcha. Sure, we'll run this weird weapon loadout. I have over a thousand badass rank and I have over a thousand badass rank. I'm not too worried about dying at this moment. Swag. Yeah! Explode myself with Teddy Ors. That's gonna get me some, that's gonna get me killed before everything goes too long. Also, let me look over here while I run. Uh, I guess this I guess some stuff is flashing in your guys' end too. That's unfortunate. Apparently putting this game at maximum settings is an issue. I'll think about that exploding gun for a bit. No, was that actually badass rank? No, it's not. Now, did the dudes respawn? No, they did not. But anyway, I should say so. Like for like while we're while we're doing this on stream for you know like main game content, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be zipping through just fine. I'm gonna be going from point A to point B really fast. But when it comes to point, but when it comes to the DLC, I'm gonna be blind. But the whole point is I want to play through at least up through the new free DLC pack that came out, just so I get the full story before jumping into Borderlands 3 for the well in the entirety. Last long, I got an exploding shotgun. And a text. Yeah, 
I'm still trying to decide on cover art for my almanac. I'm torn between an oil-painted image of myself leaping over a bullymong with a rifle in one hand and a book in the other, or the same image, except the bullymong is also exploding. Decision, there we go. Decision. It's my sister, so I need to respond back to her. Anyway. Exemplary. No, <laughs> you can't stop me. Uh, there is a... Load there it is. It's a loadout thing up here. Claptrap's on his way to the ship. Which is a main thing. But I want to get this unlocked just so I can find the rest of the audio logs. Really? That? Let's look at the new hats. Let's look at the new headwear. All right. It's just a luchador mask. It's in here somewhere. done okay so this would be a fun little excursion into this would be a fun little excursion because I could have probably should have probably done this first I like boom uh it's on top isn't it Ah, handsome Jack. Lovable asshole that you are. And that's where tape cuts off. I'm gonna sell it anyway. Alright. Let's see. Sorry, this is very unprofessional, but I don't talk to her too much, and she's had some free time now, thanks to the recent happenings. Also, I'm seeing flashes. Is that... Oh, God, that is shadows happening. <laughs> 
when the game doesn't want you to play on high settings. There we go. As much as I like the ridiculous... No. Uh-oh. That's a problem for you, not for me. Hi. Pay attention to me. I hit him. Please don't walk at me. It's a bad idea to walk at me. Bye. How did you... Whoa, hey. There goes that tanking frame rate, eh? Why it's tanking, I don't know. Yeah, actually, that's a little concerning that the frame rate is tanking. Well, that's unfortunate. It means I have to turn down some video settings. Here, let's just cap off the frame rate. See what happens. Not a, not a thing. RTX 50... Is it a 5700? Pretty sure it is. Er... Anyway, uh, let's see. But no, that's the weird thing is like, you know, streaming, for you, streaming this for you guys, like for some reason I'm tanking frames down to the 20s. But recording, recording uh, Borderlands, recording Borderlands 3 at everything on max, not an issue. Let's see, where's Shadows? Turn the physics off as well. Eh, whatever. 
Whatever, we'll just deal it with it for today. Uh, Alright, I was gonna confirm that information, wasn't I? I can do it for my phone, considering... Hold up. Because I'm pretty sure that my... That everything I ordered is probably still in the... Uh, New egg order here. Do 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 That's, well, that's it, yeah. Well, I mean, I'm pretty sure Borderlands 2 was designed with, um... If I'm thinking right, Borderlands 2 was designed with NVIDIA graphics cards in mind. Borderlands 3, because it showed up, was designed with AMD graphics cards in mind. You coming? Unfortunately, yes. Don't read into that statement. It's boo -boo. <laughs> Come on, let me get that free damage. It's Boom and his brother Boom. Don't jump at me. Don't jump at me. Bad, big mistake. Oh, thank God, a better grenade. Still a mistake. Ow. Yeah, you're a big target. I can just... I'm just gonna run up there. I don't care. Big target. Really? Oh, there you are. That works. Well, that was fun. I feel like I shouldn't have been that with that handily well off with with that fight as I was. Oh, that fight went much better. Maybe I just need to turn down the antisotropic filtering. To times 8. Because it was at times 16, as you saw. Alright. Hurry up and go faster. Hold on, Claptrap, I, listen, we can talk about how I'm going to shoot you in just a second here. Oh, I have a cust head customization to equip, that's why. Hi, Kiza. What the? No, get, young man, get out of that. Young man, get out of that turret. I feel like I was supposed to be in the gun still. Oh, well. Wait. What happened? 
whatever. Oh, that was fun. I didn't realize that was basically a classified version of go of going into a downstate. Do you mind? No, like, do you actually mind? Okay, you know what? Sorry, I'm looking over the snow. Eh. Don't worry so much about being good at the game. Just enjoy, just worry about enjoying your game. You forgive me for using uh, slang or street term on this, but I am ass at almost every fighting game I pick up because I do not have the reaction time to do what most people do in fighting games. But I still play them because I because I like them. Anyway, more skills. Too many icons. Really? I have been watching my bloodlust stacks actually, so I don't know how well I've been doing on that. Are they bull they're bullseyeing racks. That's my job. Boop. Oh, the rack took the bull took the slant the slant form. Boop! Boop, beep. Oh, it's a it's a badass. I can't do that. Not yet, anyway. It's a of blood. Hey. That's a bad idea. Oops. Whatever, just melee him down. Come back here, come back here. I was dying apparently. It happens. Get over here and smell my meat. You, Craig, you. There we go.
Eh. I don't know. I don't know what to say about that one, Keys, to be honest. Mujin is a beast of your own making, how difficult you want to make it. You ever want to hate yourself while using that knife? As far as I know, you just... As far as I'm aware, you just download and put in sad claps and... Lose every fight because you can't find him, because he hits all. Sad claps is always above me. Oh, there's a selling point right here. I can unload a little bit in a second. Boop. Alright. So... Listen, as much as I do enjoy the fact that I could- I can just cheap out some of these fights, I'm not going to. By using that grenade. Where'd that gun go? Did it fall through the world? Yes. <laughs> eh, not a better shield yet. Okay, leave me alone though. Everybody's gonna everybody's in corrosion. That should probably finish him off too. Someone's stuck. Ah, that's why I was hearing noises. Guys, I might be creaking another life. Stop moving. The more you squirm, the more I have to chase you down with an axe. Grenade out. Okay, it's time. Or not. You'll be fine, Claptrap. Be more worried about me at the moment. Stuck. See, Claptrap, you're fine. You worry too much.
Okay. I'll totally get on that right now, Claptrap. After I just loot this place dry. Not a single bit of loot left to their names. Hey, hold this. That was fun. Oh, you don't have anything nice? Why not? I love having nice things that are meant for me. Eh, probably not. I'm not going- I'm not trying to find every- I'm not trying to find all the vault symbols and whatnot, I'm just- I'm just playing to have fun, experience the whole game, get the, uh... Get the, uh, what you call it. Get the full experience of the game, then play Borderlands 3. Well, I still have to play pre-sequel. Not sure if I'll jump from this directly to pre-sequel or not. Oh, he moved. Why'd he move? Boop. Behold the power of Boop. Where? Did you stop that? You, stop that as well. You hurt me. Why'd you hurt me? I hit him. Don't even give me that guff. You ever make a mistake? I have. Twice. But no, but no more than twice. I'm not allowed to make any more two mistakes in a day. All of a sudden, the vault symbol just in the back one of one of these crates slash behind the pooper. Nope, but that but there is art of moxie everywhere. Anyway, if I remember right, there is something down here in this spot. No, there's not. Dang. I can't believe I'm just lying to you today. Just lying to your face about everything. Can you dance and cry at the same time? Is that physically possible? Does does emo music help in this in this regard? Okay, gonna have any health? Nope, just gonna have money. Fine, I'll go buy my health back. I can't buy my health back. Nope. Alright, that's all settled. Did I shoot him? I wanted to shoot him so bad. Hi, Flint. Hey, can I get your lock? Can I get your, uh, that one thing? 
Hello? Stop dodging. I made a mistake this day. Hi. Birding. Huh. I feel like I'm being punished for being too close to Flint. Going down. Uh, I'm gonna respawn, aren't I? Yep. Uh, oh my. Yeah, they are dropping. this up. Am I back yet? Am I stable? Don't worry, customer. I think I'm back. Great. Good job, Charter. Fine, I'll just stand way back here and shoot you. That's fine. Game crashing a little bit. Oh, I think I'm going to respawn again. Oh, he's really close. Cool. And then I missed both shots. Just the frames. Weird. I guess I didn't save the frames. No, that was weird then, because computer's not running super hot right now. Like it's running about as hot as it was when I uh, when I was just exporting audio earlier today. So the audio's not. So the uh, computer's not running hot. Not running hot enough to make an issue right now. You know what? Hell with it. Go away. Really. Hi, Flint. You recovered your health, Flint. Going through the fire was a bad idea, by the way. I'm gonna die. So that happened, but if I just shoot his minion right in front of him, I can continue my onslaught. I'm done with you, Flint.
Ah, uh, his tinder box sucks. Welcome back, Shade. Also, Farf, does that mean you no longer have to go to work or you or you work from home now? I am in All right. Now we just got to get to my ship. You do live in Cali, if I remember right. I don't want to sound like that kind of a dick. I can't remember where his friends live. Bad. That's bad. Oh yeah, that's right. That's the other thing. Uh, and uh, not not to talk bad about, not to really make anybody question their uh, that what their allegiance is to to the company in question here. Before I say what I'm going to say, but um, <clears throat> but. Isn't it kind of funny that GameStop is forcing their stores to stay open despite the fact that unless it is a vital industry that a store needs to be closed right now? But GameStop is arguing, well, video games are vital to humanity. We're a vital store. Bruv. Bruv. Have you never heard of a digital download? Okay. Well, that's all done. And now, let us set sail. Which is welcome back, Kiza. Which is it's actually kind of a funny thing that, um, it's actually kind of a funny thing that GameStop is arguing. No, we need to stay open. We are vital. But on the flip side, they just had the they just trying to conform to CDC regulations. Just said no. We're gonna sell Doom Eternal on the nineteenth. And Animal Crossing New Horizons on the 20th to try and keep people not as in cramped spaces if they ordered it from our store. It's like it's like they did two sides of the same coin kind of thing. Yes, we're gonna do this smart thing. And then we're gonna squander it immediately. Anyway. I'm gonna go pee. I'm gonna refill my water bottle. So you get to stare at this. Well, I will load into the next zone. <laughs> But you guys get to stare at whatever the lovely zone it is it looks like once we get back in there. So I'll be back in a minute.
Ugh. Like, yeah, you guys, I, I realize that's why I left you off on, but like, I understand both sides of the coin here in all this. On one end, you know, yeah, people still need to make money, especially in the midst of a pandemic, unfortunately. Anyway, but no, I understand like the, the both sides of it of that. Yeah, people still have to make money. But then there's the other side of, you know, if you, if you endanger people, people can't spend money, uh, can't spend money at your facilities. It just, it just kind of sucks either way you, you look at it and think about it, really. Like, it's getting, like, the, the world is getting a little better, bit by bit as well, with all this going on. Because, like, I went out, uh, I went out to buy some groceries earlier today. I went out and bought some groceries just earlier today. And I was actually, and I was like, oh, I'm, I got, my roommate has some toilet paper, but I'm down to my last roll. I should probably see if I can find some while I'm out there. I actually found some toilet paper, but pasta noodles, pasta noodles are just gone. There is no pasta noodles found. I found, I found two boxes. I, I bought, ended up buying two boxes of pasta noodles, but they were like Primo brand box stuff. We, they're like Primo brand stuff that's in a fancy box and they're made with chickpeas, which chickpeas are not, chickpeas are not a bad thing. They're just like vegan alternatives for your protein. That's really all chickpeas are, because chickpeas are garbanzo beans, effect, uh, still. So beans are also protein, yada yada, I'll stop talking about this. Um, but, but yeah, and anything that's not ground beef or steak for meats was just gone. There is no ground beef. There is no, like I usually have been eating uh, now, it, there is no ground turkey. There's no, there's no like made or from the meat market, so to say, chicken breasts. There's none of that stuff there. It's ground beef, and that's about it. <laughs> okay. All right, hey guys, it me. But I will say that, like, between my two trips, like, the pasta noodles being gone, that still hasn't been restocked, whatever, that'll happen back with time. The toilet paper being gone, it's now there. It's only been, I, last time I went to the grocery store, it was a week ago. So, it only took a week to restock toilet paper. Not a big issue anymore. So, I just imagine over the next week or so, people who have hoarded will have to deal with their what they hoarded. While sensible people like myself, who only get what they need, or go on a week-by-week -week basis, damn it, I did it again. People like myself, who only go and get their stuff on a week-by-week -week basis, will... Where's my shotgun? There it is. Only people who go on like a week-by-week -week basis and get what they need for the week will be able to still get our stuff. It's just going to take a while to get back to that point. Get that grenade out there. Act. Damn it. Can I, you know, can I help you? And we hide.
yeah, it's... What is it? There's a picture I saw. I don't know if it's truthful, but, uh... It looks like Costco is kind of standing their ground on some of this stuff. Because a lot Because Costco, for anybody who doesn't know, it's, uh... Uh, Sam's Club is another alternative for this. Uh, I don't know if Ralph's does bulk, but... Basically, stores that have... Stores that sell bulk or economy-sized, uh... Economy-sized material- uh, goods. Like, people have gone to those stores to stock up and stuff, because it's like, hey, I can buy ungodly- It's like the Jim Gaffigan joke of, will I live long enough to eat this to eat this entire jar of mayonnaise? Kind of thing. It seems like those ma major suppliers have- put a stand up or put a stance just like we will not be accepting returns on toilet paper, hand sanitizer, san sanitization wipes, you know, all those things that people have been hoarding up. Because hoarding up. I imagine I imagine look, I'm call me, call me slightly vindictive or socio. I don't know I keep, I've looked up the definition of sociopath in the past and I forget what it is now. But I know it's doing this. Hold on. You guys can't see this, but I need to adjust something. Uh. I think that's half the issue. It's because the Discord overlay in games is causing this to happen. I'm not in the voice chat, so I don't need this Discord overlay. Anyway. But anyway, uh, I'm, I digress from the point. Huh. He might like weapons that do explosion damage that are really high in... That are really high in magazine size. Okay. Anyway, I got dis I distracted myself. Oh, that's a blue. I might need this as an alternative for a while. You can't stop me. Good. Anyway, but anyway, uh, I like I said, I digressed. It seems like a big economy selling stores are going to take a stand, saying, "Hey, you can't return that stuff." Sociopath of being kind of psycho about it is I, I don't know the word. Um, can you tell how how terrible my multitasking skills are? Basically, I am kind of a cynicist. That's the word I'm looking for, cynicist, or an asshole, <laughs> in thinking that people are going like we're going to hit the first of the month, and these same people who have been hoarding all this stuff, gathering it all up, spent way too much money on it, who now can't go to work, now have to try and turn around and return all that stuff to the stores because they can't hoard it all because they can't afford to hoard it all and every st and now they're just going to be stuck with it in their pockets Executing phase shift. oh I just need to get myself my... Let's just look at the new ones. Alright. Plasma blue. Look at, look at all the skins I got here. Done. Rocket launcher, deploy vehicle, and teleport to vehicle. So yeah, it's gonna be kind of funny if that actually holds true, if like... That's gonna... It'll be kind of funny at, like at the end of the month when it actually turns around and they can't afford to do that. Or they can't afford to have gone through that lifestyle. Meanwhile, the rest of us who've just been living the same way since this pandemic started are just like, yeah, we're just... I'm just gonna go and buy what I need now. And the stores are gonna be overstocked with that stuff. 
It's gonna be, it's just gonna be some weird vindication. Especially cause the fact that these people are... Rude. I was driving there. Um, it's just that those people who have been hoarding like they are right now, I have, you know, the people that are hurting are the ones that can't get, a, get to a store that easily or that need that stuff the most, like the elderly or the, immu the immune deprived, who are the ones who are going to have the most issue at the moment. Car. Hey, there he is. Boop. Ow, my car. I forgot what the handbrake button was. Are you done? How can they tell the difference? I'm Krieg. Oh, so you're the one I've been hearing all this radio chatter about. Name's Roland. I used to be a vault hunter like you. Until I fought the Crimson Raiders. We'll catch up when I get back to Sanctuary. For now, I need your help. My men tell me Corporal Reese hasn't returned the power core that we need to keep the city shields running. Bring Reese back to Sanctuary, and you'll have earned your place in the Raiders. Roland's contacted you? Good. Listen to what he says. He can help us defeat Jack. Alright, Mr. Roland. I'll do what you say, Mr. Roland. Yes, sir. Oh, Captain, my captain! Reminding you all not to worry your pretty little heads about those earthquakes. See, with every tremor, my drill gets closer to the vault. To freedom, order, and safety for us all. Except you assets and such. Well, that was fun. Anyway, now that I'm done with this semi-depressing story, semi-depressing moment, or my unfounded vindication might have problems. I hope you guys have been staying safe amidst all this crazy that's been going on. Oh, hi. Shoot me, dang it. Oh, that's a big boy. Ow. I've been hit. Ow, I've been hit again. Eh, I might be able to get him in time. Hold on. And of course, now he runs away. Damn it. Oh, does it actually just throw away the bolts that are in the gun? That's that's I didn't know that. Thank you. Not uh, not being condescending by the way. I just I actually didn't know that. I don't use Teddy Ors a lot. We at Hyperion wish to thank you for your attempts to Hey y'all, what's the news, Brim? Can you rest? So I guess I gotta think about it. I gotta think about it like using the uh Force of Nature in TF2, really. Oh yeah, that does just get rid of the bullets, doesn't it? <laughs> Noted. Anyway. I'm not running up. Where are you? I can never die! Oh, 
Well, look what you've done. I hope you're proud of yourself. Throw in, lobbed. That one's better. On oh, full. Hey, sir. Sir. Don't do it. Don't do it. Well, I made a mistake. I'm full on guns again. Oh well. I could have gone around the mountain. Oops. Well then, let me actually drive around instead. Yeah, a lot of... Bo it seems like a lot of... From what I've seen of people playing this game in Borderlands... Th or playing Borderlands 3, it seems like a lot of Teddy Air guns always have an alternative firing method, which makes them better-ish? Makes them bedish. It makes them bed. <laughs> ah yes, Krieg. Just, just do a, just go, just swan dive into the driver's seat. Yep. Oh, well, that was fun while it lasted. Oh! Boldymon, you're in my way, See, sir. Sir, you're in my way. Well, I mean, there's there's the obvious of there's the obvious thing of everybody gangster till the gun starts starts walking of Teddy Ors. I will fight you in my car, Sam. I am. Get off of there. Oh, that's a gun. I'm gonna leave it alone. Well, some of the Teddy Orguns walk. I can't hear you. I'm, I can't see. Go away. I said go away. Hmm, you don't listen very well, do you? Maybe you'll listen better to my axe. I think you heard me now. I missed. Hi, guys. Oh my god. Buzz off. Reese is dead. He was one of the first Crimson Landsmen I recruited to the Raiders. Get that power core back, and while you're at it, kill some bandits for Reese. That's what he would have wanted. Looks like you've got an area waypoint. Sometimes your echo device can't find the precise location of what you're looking for. I am tired of racks. There is so much easier just bullseye in Borderlands 1 with a shotgun. Yes, I know what I said. You mean you don't bullseye racks with a shotgun? Someone lied to me. Wolf lied to me. Uh, 
there's part of me that really wants to re-upload the uh, Puddle Play series of Borderlands. Uh, like, re-render it out and re-upload it. Re-render it in 4K and re-upload it because... I've been having a lot, uh, like, uploading my videos on YouTube now in 4K has been a boon. Because it's in 4K, so YouTube has to render all of that pixel space out now. So it has to look nice now. It's still 10, I still only recorded at 1080p, but it's forced it to record, I forced it to, four, to 4K. Get him, Krieg. Shoot. One shot. Two shot. Everybody found my saw blade. Come here. Stop running. Running is a bad idea. It makes you so you stop dying. And you need to be dying. Well, I'm going to go down. Got him. That's the power core. Great. Jack won't destroy sanctuary. It's damaged. Now get back to the ship. We'll meet up once I get there. Welcome to the Crimson Rick. Oh, damn it. I'm being attacked. I'll see you. <laughs> Throw a grenade in there. Oh, here, this is my friend. Hey, come back here. No, come back here. Throw a grenade and bring out the axe. Where'd he go? Where'd this one go? There he is. There he is. Yeah, I think I kind of understand why a lot of people say Krieg sucks to play as until you hit like level 20 or 25 or 30. Hi. Well, he put fire down. Damn it. Oh, this will be an issue for a while. This will be a long running issue. Everybody get comfy. Scooter suffering. Get your popcorn out if you got it. Munch on it. I want you to note that I said munch, not munch. <sighs> He's taunting me. No, you give it up. Well, you have a gun in your head. Come back here. Hi. But I'm sure Reese would have been happy to know how quickly you wiped out those bloodshots. Quickly, he says. Oh, you broke my shield. It's time. Now, where's the rest of your friends? Okay, they're not here. Oh, there they are. 
Oh. He's dead. Why why are you running? Why are you running? Anyway, the reason why I did want to kill them all is because at some point throughout all this, there will be... At some point throughout this mess, there will eventually be a uh, treasure chest in hopes of good loot. You know, good loot. Loot loot. There's the treasure chest. And watch you be a bad loot box. Huh. Oh, it's a sniper rifle. I was like, oh boy, that looks interesting. Jacob's sniper rifle, Jacob's assault rifle. Faster reload speed, bigger magazine. Not much less accurate. A lot less fire rate. Er, I'm looking at it wrong. Looking at it backwards. Oh, but it's Jacob's. Well, let's drop some let's drop some whites at least to pick those up. I always get there's always at least one time per play session while playing Borderlands where I, where I get my where I get everything backwards on what what's going on with gun par comparisons. I'll leave that be. It's a white anyway. I'll probably have something better in a little while. All right, we can leave the, we can leave this camp behind. So, of the people that are, I've, I don't know, for anybody lurking, apologies if, apologies if I feel like I'm calling you people out who are lurking, but for those that have been active in the chat, I feel like your plans, I was going to ask what's your plans for the weekend, but I feel like it mostly falls along the lines of Animal Crossing and co coercing the villagers I want to see in my village, whilst I re re terraform this entire island. Sound about right? Ooh, iridium. As I run away from my car. I think what I might do this weekend, I think what I might do uh, for sat well, Saturday, uh, stream-wise, is I might try and do like a music day stream. What I'm going to, what I'm going to try and do, what I'm, what I'm going to try and do tomorrow is have uh, my, is have my roommate log into his Steam account on my computer so we can, so I can share, so he can share his library to me. And so I can retry that whole, um, so I can retry that whole streaming VR games bit I had before. Oh no, Rolando is dead though. Roland? Dead? It's crazier than you might think. Oh boy, I'm gonna earn his secret. Hi. You're the one Commander Roland was talking about. The one who faced Jack and lived. Look, we need your help bad. But first things first, plug that power cord into the shield generator. Dead it. Can I have goodies now? Okay. Stand up straight. We got a bolt hunter headed your way. Blitz! Look alive, everybody! <laughs> Hyperion Moonshot Blitz. Without that fresh core you brought, those lunar mortars would have punched right through the shield. 
Let me in. Constant vigilance. Okay, can you let me in? Thanks. Oh boy. I mean, uh, darn. Roland needs your help. Without you, the Crimson Raiders don't stand a chance against Jack. Please find out where Roland's gone. Sanctuary. Built on the ruins of the Dahl Corporation's finest interplanetary mining ship. Now the last refuge for thieves, murderers, and outcasts. Welcome home. Okay. Hey guys. Guess. Hold on. Curve. Look. Hit me. Oh, crap. Did you have Perry? I heard all of you were robots and you eat metal out the garbage and stuff. Do you wire deck machines to come for me once Roland went missing? Now, if you're here to kill me, you should probably know. <laughs> You'll never take me alive, you robotic stone bitch! Yeah, yeah, you keep talking. I'm gonna keep raiding your 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 store your wares because you always have iridium in here somewhere. Thanks. Getting a little ahead of the curve, I think. Well, let's head to center of town and plug those two fuel cells into the ignition primer. Eh, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Just with a fork. No, that's fine. No, you do you, man. Don't, don't worry. You don't have to be constantly talking. I hear a new vault hunter has arrived in your city, so just turn him into me, and you'll be rewarded. Don't worry. Nobody's gonna turn you in. You're our only hope of stopping. Roland said we gotta have an exit strategy just in case he ever disappeared and sell fuel cells and whatnot. Uh, bummer though. They really wanted to meet you. Raiders ain't gonna last without some new blood. And given how you shot them bandits up, I'd say you and blood got an extra special relationship. Like cousins taking a bath together. <laughs> oh. Please. What you want? Just buy something. I'll talk in this crap fuel cell. <laughs> Just touch the major. Well, first things first, backpack upgrade. I only accept iridium. Cash is for clowns, boy. And with my forest red rock, let's get shotgun upgrade. Yeah, yeah, okay. Got it. And fuel cell. Or not. Or not. Damn. Well, now we really gotta find Roland. You know what? Maybe get to Roland's place. I think he might have left a message there for you. You can't. Okay, good to know. And away it all goes. Fine, I'll, I'll proceed with the story. Are we having fun? 
Yep, I've got another weapon slot now. Right now, you're the only thing standing between this city, hell, the whole planet, and Handsome Jack's army. I left info about my whereabouts in my safe. You can use it to store anything you need. This is your home now. Good luck. Oh boy, the safe, aka the character transfer spot. Okay, that's nice. You mean the mass murder of the bounty hunter? Oh, crap. It's Firehawk's got him rolling to deep. You gotta get Frostburn Cannon and rescue his ass. If Roland has been captured by the Firehawk, he's in danger. You're the only one who can stop Jack, but Roland is the man with the plan, so to speak. He knows the best way to strike at Hyperion. Okay, I'll do that, but first I gotta meet our lovely cast of characters that'll be helping us throughout our adventure. Could I have refund, please? This gun doesn't seem to work. Hmm, I don't know. <laughs> Looks like it works to me. Uh, Marcus, you son of a gun. You're a lovable son of a gun. Uh, also, I just remembered he has to be the last one you talk to. No, no, we're gonna call them bully monks. Cause, you know, we can't really call them boner farts. It's not like that's ever gonna happen. Nobody would ever call them boner farts. Found it. I forgot what I had all put in here, to be honest. I mean, I, I mean, I mean. I mean, I mean, so how's life? How's things going? Is everything going fine? I mean, I'm just holding my mouse down. Uh, I forgot I had this thing. I'm keeping it. I'm keeping it until it gets all class in like three levels, but. Even though you didn't bring me what I asked for, I decided to let you use that stash to share weapons between my minions. Sure, sure. Keep talking, Claptrap. I'm going to go see Zed. I'm starving. I want to eat your babies. Son, this might sting a bit. Shade. 
I want you to remember what what time we, what we're what we're dealing with right now, and then tell me and and also tell me say psych right now. Say psych right now. Oh. All right, make a small incision just Stick. I didn't read that. The I and the T blended together on my uh, readout over here. Surgery. Hey, Ridrock. An iridium shard offer? How many times I tell you idiots, you can't get slag powers by swallowing this stuff. Well, that shard ain't no good in the black market. Didn't refine it yet. You could probably take it to that Tannis lady on the other side of town. She's real into that Iridium stuff. She ain't acting all hoity toity because she's got a real doctorate. Go away. Let me know if you're looking for work. I got stuff that you're doing. Okay, now we can go meet Tannis. Hi, Tannis. As I've said, Roland, now that Jack has the vault key, it is only a matter of time until he opens the vault. Also, I require a new ventilator. This lab smells of bacon. Bacon is for sycophants and products of incest. Hey, Tannis, look what I found. After hours of scientific insanity, you can only imagine in your dreams or in my bed standing over, I have deduced that Jack the vault key and the iridium are all connected on a deeper level. Here, hold this wood rock. Come on back whenever you need some healing. As long as you ain't scared of a little tetanus anyways. Totally not, totally not going to become something important later on. Nope. Nah. -uh. Nope. Won't be happening. That's all good. Uh, let's see. I need to get my next skill point. Oh, hey, look, my skill point. Uh. You know, I've noticed I haven't really gotten any bloodlust. Ah, uh, so this is where I get bloodlust stuff. Okay, noted. Huh, neat. Use the number buttons to switch between weapons. Neato burrito. Hi, Marcus. I'm here to test your weapons. Get over here. Hey, Vault Hunter. If you're going to be a part of the Crimson Raiders, you better know how to use elemental weapons, <sighs> don't you think? I've just got a crate of spanking new Malawan elemental weapons. Wanna help me test them out? But of course. I'll see you in the firing range. Let's try out the fire weapon first, huh? Certainly. Let me just uh, swap swap this off. All right, Marcus. Let me t let me learn about fire. Fire weapons are extremely effective against flesh, but they're crap at destroying shields. Did it. This Hyperion fascist thinks he's safe because he's got a shield. Spoilers, he isn't. It's only a matter of time until Jack burns this city to the ground. Take that, Jack Lover. Yeah, a few good hits from a shock weapon will zap a shield away quicker than you can say buyer's remorse. Now what else? Ah, armor. Armor 
armored targets like these damn Hyperion robots can take a lot of damage. What help? Unless you've got a corrosive weapon. Weapons may only be sold by Hyperion representatives. All non Hyperion arms dealers will be forcibly relocated to Jackville. See how the acid eats through the metal? I must confess, I love corrosive weapons. Oh boy, the worst weapon type of them all. New slag weapons. Slag is a bit more complex. If you slag your enemy, all non-slag damage will hurt even more. Here, slag this chunk. Boop. Now that he's slagged, he should be needed on the red chunk. Switch to another weapon and hit him again. I did. Come back here. Let's talk about your payment. Your payment is experience. Purchase any elemental weapons like these. You could always buy some from your friendly neighborhood arms dealer. Go back in your shop, Marcus. Now that we're done playing with this, I'm gonna put this back I'm gonna put this back on. Just Just infinite pistol. Doesn't use any doesn't use any ammo. Infinite pistol. Buy one for the kids. Buy one for your mom. Buy one for the whole house. And no reloading needed either. Sorry, Marcus. I won't repair your shop. Okay. So it is starting to get a little late here. I think before I end things off, let's do a little bit of gambling just to see if we can get lucky with anything here. And by a little bit, I mean too much. Because I never learned my lesson. Case in point. You would think she wouldn't keep grenades and she you would think they wouldn't put grenades in an establishment like this, but whatever. So am what am I, 50% right now on getting grenades? More gambling, because I don't learn my lesson. I'll stop eventually. Also, this this uh, goes up. This goes the price. This goes up depending upon your level. But so do the rewards. Eh, I think I'll go to about three thousand or so before I stop. Which means this is my last pull. Thanks for the money. I'm out. See? I can gamble responsibly. Dangerous to go alone, jerkwad. Eh, I don't really I don't really depend upon my grenades so yet, so. Eh, we'll wait. Where are you, Scrap it? Scrap it! <laughs> what did you do to Scrap? Where's Scrappy? Answer now. If you answer me, I will stop shooting the door. He's not answering. Scrappy is his... That's the name of it. Is his skag puppy. Pet. No others? Okay, no others. Anyway. I think with... I think with all these quests loaded up, I think that gives us plenty, plenty to work with come tomorrow. Come to... Not tomorrow. Come... Unless I do that music stream on Saturday, which I'll discuss a little bit more about before we wrap up here. 
Uh, if we don't do this music stream on Saturday, I'll leave it to a Twitter poll once again for what we do on Saturday stream. So, yeah, I think we're at a good spot. Uh, so just to talk about a little bit, what I mean by this music stream is, if I can get if I can get all the stuff for VR set up again, I'll probably start playing like Beat Saber and stuff like that just to kick off the day. Maybe I'll play a little Audio Shield so I can just put in whatever songs I feel like into the program instead of downloading songs from other people. So, we'll mess I'll mess around with that tomorrow at some point, amidst my plan me planning and recording. Another side project because I have all the time in the world to record side projects right now. <clears throat> um, and then I'm thinking I will also do, because I, I just realized I have enough songs for us, I think I might do another Name That Game Tune uh, thing. For those of you that ha haven't been part of it or haven't seen it, basically I've grabbed up about 50 mu video game music tracks and you guys guess it. And then you compete for points and highest score wins. It's very simple. I'll probably explain it more in depth once that actually comes along. But we'll see if I can get the first part, the actual VR working part, set up first before I do anything else. Anyway. Does anybody have any questions for me before I end off this evening's stream? As it is almost 10.30. Wow. Okay, good. I, I did my job right. Tears. Skull. Uh, I am going to exit the game. I was hoping to get to level 10, no lie, but eh, level 9 is good enough. That boy is like all torso. Anyway. And then... While I wait for the overflooding of questions, I'm going to go ahead and see if I can't get you guys somebody to jump to if you guys are still looking to watch Twitch for the evening. Oh, no problem. And I think I left you guys only an hour and a half left as well before Animal Crossing launches. At least time-wise for me, it's an hour and a half away, though I'm not playing it. But it may also be tied to uh, Pacific Coast. To the Pacific Coast. The. So who knows if it's actually going to go live in an hour and a half, or if, we'll go, or if it's going to go live in half an hour for the East Coast people. Or if it's going to go live in three and a half hours for the West Coast. Anyway. So for where we send it off to tonight, your choices are... Uh, Kyle Ken is playing Final Fantasy Record Keeper. It looks like a, it looks like a Final Fantasy gotcha. I don't know what it is. <laughs> um, kiddo is playing Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. I'm pretty sure he is going to be switching to Animal Crossing as soon as it loads up worldwide. Uh, Botanic Sage, I believe, is also the same. Also playing Smash Ultimate right now, but probably will also switch over to Animal Crossing when it goes live. Uh, Alan Edgehead is playing Rune Factory 4. I don't know if he's also going to switch over to Animal Crossing when the time comes. Or Icy Hedgy, who is playing Pokemon Ruby, or Ruby Sapphire. I think he's doing a randomizer. Might be doing a randomizer. I'm not sure. So, <sighs> run down the list again. Kyle Ken, Kenny, Final Fantasy Record Keeper. Kiddo, Smash Ultimate, probably switching to Animal Crossing. Botanic Sage, Smash Ultimate, probably switching to Animal Crossing. Alan Edgehead, Rune Factory 4, might also be switching to Animal Crossing. And I see playing Pokemon. Where would you like to go this evening, my friends? Your choice.
All right. Eh, you know what? I'll pass it off to Kiddo tonight, then. I didn't see any responses yet, so I'll pass it off to Kiddo. So, just give him nice hellos and highs. No, nothing, no fancy raid message. But, thanks everybody for coming out tonight. And I'll see you on Saturday. Later, folks.